Do's and Don'ts When Preparing for Exams Welcome to Amazing Kenya TV. We've all been there. You look at the calendar and see your first exam date looming. You think about how much revision time your teachers seem to mention every few minutes in class. All the different subjects, modules and topics that could be there when you open your exam document. Studying and knowing the material is clearly essential, but taking an exam entails a lot more. Managing time, reading the question clearly, answering what's actually being asked, and dealing with distractions are just some of the exam preparation tips your teen needs to know. Let's go through these do's and don'ts smart study for success in your exams. Do's 1. Get your timings right. One of the biggest challenges facing students every year is getting the timing right so that there is enough time to answer all questions needed. Come up with a clear time guide and write it on the front cover of your exam paper showing the actual time you should be starting each question. Then, in the middle of the exam you will be able to look at your watch and easily see how many questions you should have done at that time. 2. Bring everything you need. It may sound simple but a lot of stress can be avoided by making sure you have everything you need to do the exam. Make a checklist the night before each exam. Then go through it before you leave home and again before entering the exam hall. It's a good idea to bring some snacks into the exam hall. Bananas and cereal bars are good. Avoid bringing noisy foods such as crisps that will distract everyone else. 3. Do the easiest questions first. There is no reason to do the questions in the order they are printed in the exam. There are a couple of reasons for this. Firstly, Getting the first question done well will help calm you and get you focused for the rest of the exam. 4. Get the basics right. Okay, you've heard it a million times before but make sure you get the basics right. Read the questions carefully, underline key parts, and put your exam number on your answer booklet. Get familiar with the layout of the exam paper. Some papers are tricky and complicated instructions could throw you on the day. Know the meanings of the key question words. 5. Read the whole paper before writing anything. One of the most important exam preparation tips to drill in during the run-up to exams, read every question before you write anything. Don't get stuck in straight away. Read the paper from start to finish at least once before you begin writing. There are often choices to be made within the exam, so planning before you start is the best idea. 6. Ask the invigilator. If you're stuck on the meaning of the word or can't understand what a question requires you to do, Put your hand up and ask the invigilator who is supervising the exams. More often than not they'll help you or point you in the right direction. 7. When running out of time, if you find yourself with time for only one question but two questions are left to do, the best thing here is to do the first half of both questions. Often, you gain more marks in the first half of a question than at the end. Also, if time is tight, bullet points can be a great way of getting the information down as quickly as possible. Don'ts. 1. Have a realistic revision schedule. Planning your study in advance will allow you to prepare and cover everything you might need to know. Even if you have a shorter study window than you thought, planning that time is better than not planning at all. 2. Don't panic. Easier said than done we know, but it's important to try and keep level-headed throughout the exam. One of the main reasons for stress at exam time is the lack of control. Students get stressed because they don't know what is coming up. 3. Don't leave out questions. From experience. The main reason students underperform in exams is not because they answer questions badly, but because they leave out questions. As a rule of thumb, every long question you leave out will drop you by a grade. 4. Don't get stuck on a question. If you get a particularly hard question, don't sit there panicking about it. The best thing you can do is having a quick think about it, mark it with a highlighter and move on to another question. The chances are that by the time you come back to it, your subconscious mind will have already set you up to make an attempt at it. 5. Don't bother looking around the exam hall. One of the most common things students do, especially in exams they find difficult, is look around and try to see how their classmates are doing. There is really no point in doing this and it is likely that seeing others furiously writing away will only serve to stress you further. Concentrate on your own exam and try and keep your focus on your own paper. 6. Be calm and kind to yourself. It is an important time for you, but you should be able to enjoy this time and be proud of how far you've come. 7. Don't leave an exam early. There is always something you can do to improve your...